Today I'm going to show you how to create this coral fall makeup look. So the first step I would recommend is a hyaluronic acid serum. This one is from the Inky List. And then you want to go in with your moisturizer. I'm going to go in with the Blurring Skin Tint from Fenty. It is amazing. This is the Smashbox Halo Plumping Dew and Hyaluronic Acid Serum. It makes your skin look incredible. This is the best foundation that I've ever used and it is the Too Faced Born This Way Matte Foundation. It's 24 hours wear. I like a full coverage foundation and this is it. For my contour stick, I'm gonna be using a foundation stick from Anastasia Beverly Hills in the shade Truffle. So when you want your contour, everything to go up. The concealer of choice is the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in Light Vanilla 2. So I touch all the dark and I'm kind of starting to sweep this up. I'm gonna go back in with my foundation sponge and I'm gonna use this for the concealer. See how hard to find it is? So the next step in our coral fall look has to be a fun corally blush. So I'm just gonna take a regular blush brush and apply it that way. In order to set the full face, you can just do a sweep over of powder and the powder that I like to use in order to do that is the Born This Way Ethereal Setting Powder from Too Faced. And then I'm gonna bring it all over the face. My eyebrow product of choice has always been the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in the shade Taupe. I start by pulling my eyebrows up, follow the line that's already pretty natural to your eyebrow. And then I'm gonna kind of just fill in the ideal shape that I want this to take. It's time for eyes. We have two palettes that we're gonna be using. The first one is the Naked Reloaded palette, and then a little mini Natasha Denona palette. This is going to be a neutral color that is going to act as a neutral palette for you to build this coral look on top of. You also wanna make sure to bring this over I'm gonna focus this on the outer corner of the eye. If you wanna think of this as like a C shape right here, and we're gonna really focus just here on the outer edge. So it should look like that. We're going in with a Dazzle Shadow. It's a liquid shadow by MAC. Go into the center of your eye, take your pinky, try your best to keep it on the lid. I fell in love with this product. It's the Quick Stick from Tarte. I'm going to use it as an inner corner highlight today because I think it's a very simple way to get a very good inner corner highlight. Now we're going to take the eyeliner portion of it. We're just gonna do the slightest amount here under our eye and I'm gonna smudge it out as if it's eyeshadow. I am going to use just like a regular liquid black eyeliner on top of my eyes. This one is the Line Stiletto by Maybelline. I always start in the center. And do you see where like the eyeshadow is? That's how I start the line for where I want my wing liner to kind of come out of. All right, so the next step that we're gonna focus on is mascara. This is a new mascara that MAC just came out with. It's called the MAC Stack. My personal favorite lipstick is this Kylie Lip Kit. It's in the shade Coco K. My favorite lip gloss right now is from Too Faced. It's the High Shine Sparkling Lip Gloss in the shade Two Night Stand. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video as much as I enjoyed creating this look. Once again, I'm Emily Klein. If you love this video, make sure you subscribe to our channel for more videos just like this one.